Welcome to the backstage pass and the talk all through the paddock after the race in China was this man, Eric Stark, the 26-year-old from Stockholm. Tell you what, a nice surprise for you. You worked hard to get there. You finally finished a race and you got yeah. a podium. Yes, it was, uh, it was amazing. You know, the team worked so hard that weekend and we had, work, we had about home for the summer and, you know, all the guys worked and we, you know, I think we tried, we find a good solution now in the boat and it paid off in China, so we, we hope we can do it again. Well, known uh, as the dominator in Formula 2, we've had some drivers that come from Formula 2 that really haven't made an impression, but you, like uh, Jonas Anderson, a fellow Swede, really came off and uh, it looks like you're starting to get the feel of this sport. Yes, you know, uh, it's a big difference to go from the Formula 2, the Mulgaard, and into the DAC in the Formula 1. The driving style is completely different, but now I'm starting to, to you know, get comfortable in the boat and uh, it starts to feel really good. Yeah, and now, of course, uh, you've raced here before because we opened up the season eight months ago here. You qualified 13th. Do you think that's going to help you? <sighs> Last, last time here we had a fuel problem all the weekend, so I didn't do any laps with with the 100% engine working. Um, so I don't think we can, you know, take so much from the last race. But uh, of course I know that the course now, so it will be easier to, you know, to go out testing in the beginning. But uh, you know, after China. I feel very comfortable, and you know, I hope we can do it again. <laughs> All right, the Swedish driver comes from the, out of the dark. This man, Eric Stark, is looking to dominate. Let's find out if he can do the same. You got your first podium. Can you get your second one here in Doha? I hope. I cross my fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Let's find out if the young Swede can do it. 